Hello friends, welcome again to the world of maths by Amir. So this is again a time for your question, my solution. This question is uploaded by Sanju Modi on our Facebook group. If you're not on our Facebook group, I would say must join the group. Link of the group is given in the description. So I don't know the source of the question, but the question is uploaded by Mr. Sanju Modi. The question is in front of you, a classical question of quadratic equation. The question is given alpha beta belongs to the real number one of the most important data are the roots of the equation ax square plus bx plus c if there is a number k which means again a real number lies between the roots then among the options which option is correct i would say please pause the video try to solve this question and i will use the basic concept use the basic concept so I hope you have paused the video and question ko solve kiya hua. Now check the solution part. So I'm going to use the basic concept of the quadratic equation. If we have two roots alpha and beta and a number lies in between roots, it means what? If number lies in between roots means alpha and beta are the two different values, tabhi to roots lie karega kahi pe. And alpha and beta are real, it means we have two type of graph one is upward graph and would cut the x-axis x-axis ko means cut karega that's why real roots roots mil rahe. the second one is the downward graph so we have two type of graph this one is alpha this one is beta this one is alpha this one is beta and we have a k value in between the roots Aapke paas k value hai. when we have this graph when the a is positive a positive hai, we have this graph and this value ke liye hamara jo number hai that is the entire function ax square plus bx plus c is negative because ab dekho negative hai when we multiply a positive number a is positive and a negative number we will get nothing but a square x square plus abx main first aur second ko multiply kar raha hu plus c is again negative because when a positive and negative multiplies we will get nothing but a negative we have another graph when we get this graph when the a is negative when we have the coefficient of x square is negative graph downward hota hai but isme agar hum k ki value nikal to is k ke liye agar main yahan pe k put kar du yahan pe x square ko main k put karna tha that is a square k square plus a b k plus c a ye negative hoga agar yahan pe is equation mein main k put kar du to we have a k square plus b k plus c ye positive hoga because this much positive a is negative this one is positive when we multiply we will get nothing but a square k square plus a b k plus c a ye abhi aapka negative hoga so when a positive multiply with a negative we will get nothing but a negative so we have a square k square this one is this one is value this one is not applicable a b k so this one is not a b k a c is negative so answer is nothing but option number b i hope it is okay so whenever you have a quadratic equation or any function think logically think graphically if you can and work on the basic concept so the answer of this question is option number b and with the help of graph or we know the sign of the function would change in between the roots Wo basic concept hum kabhi aur dekhenge. so this was a logical and graphical aspect of this question answer of this question is nothing but option number b i hope this one is okay to you okay sanju if you have any doubt ping me on the facebook group God bless you. Happy learning and bye-bye.